have in my hand today a receipt of my of my life savings sister savings a sister thrown out the window so if you can't tell behind me right there I bought, in total, $300 worth of James Charles apparel. Listen, Linda, I'm a sister. Some people might think I'm a brother. Most times I look like a guy. Today I look emo, so we're stepping up the ladder a bit. That's progress. And in my heart, progress is all that matters. I went ahead and couldn't help myself but buy his apparel when he launched the athletic line. And I didn't buy everything, but like I bought some things and like that happens, right? I was finally able to get some of the other things on his fashion line. Is that what it's called? Mr. Charles. You're not watching this, but if maybe um in another world ever come across this video, I just wanna let you know. You're 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 amazing. I'm pretty sure you're excited to see what I got and like try it on. And if you're not, then like I recommend you click on that. My hair has color today. Oh my god! <laughs> Blast! So the first thing I want you guys to see is this. I am obsessed with socks. I was most excited out of everything about these socks and hello they say sisters and they're so cute. Let me just put one on for you. One of each. These are the sister socks two pack and they range for $25. They come in the cutest little box. You can store sister soles in here and just kind of like keep your youth contained. So that's amazing. I'll put it on and I'll let you guys know how it goes okay. So far so good. I have really big calves because I'm short. I'm just thick. Okay, with the CK and that two C's, they don't look that cute on me. But the quality, Harley by Jesus, they kind of remind me of the soccer socks from like Nike. I like the black ones way more than the white ones. <laughs> I'll just bring you down. This is the white side. I definitely prefer the black one because they just make your legs like slimmer and thinner. These are so cute though. You feel like a cheerleader. That's amazing. Again, the quality, <laughs> just got my knees. I like it, so you should totally get it. Plus, it's the sisters. Beauty guru mode up. This is me taking off my socks. And this is them off. This is me again taking off my other sock. So the only downside for me is that my feet is a size five on good days and a six on bad days. Basically fit into children's shoes. So that's how small my feet are. And um, this is definitely not a five. My feet ends about here and this bulges out to the back of my ankles or cankles if you must. But I don't really care. I pay the money, I'm gonna wear it. Moving on. James, are you watching? Okay, I need to stop. I need to calm down. So I got the original champion sweatpants and I got the size medium because I feel like small will be a little tight on my thighs. This was for $45, so <clears throat> I'm just gonna sister scoot and um, change because my windows are open and like, I swear that guy's the camera. Oh my God. You guys are gonna be excited to see this one. Why the hell do I look like this is too big and too long for me. Ridiculous. Ridiculous, okay? Short people problem. Okay, the angle you're at is not doing me justice at all. It's literally making me look like an egg with penguin feet. That's not cute. I think all you have to So here's the trick. This is what you do. You just wanna roll it, okay? You roll it like this, and then you pull. Roll and pull. Roll and pull. It's gonna create that tightness. We want, we want that tightness. I'm gonna show you the finished product. You're gonna look like this. Wow. That looks like that. And this is what you want, you know? Um, no, 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 no. So these are the sweatpants after, and this is what you want. You want it to be like this. How do you do this? 
still looking like a three foot tall. Here's my review on this. My review on this sweatpants is that it's not sister's fault. It's definitely champion. So I prefer thicker sweatpants so they like have shape, you know? But the champion sweatpants, they tend to droop a lot. However, the quality is amazing. With me being short, um, I just have to continuously pull since James is a couple years younger than me. Does that make me Auntie Faye? I'm skinny. I like to be like cousin. I'm gonna keep the sweatpants on for now. Wow, what do we have here? Oh my god, I think it's a t-shirt. This is only $25 and no cents. Look how long it is on me though. This is in medium. What did I say? It is super long on me, which I don't mind if I'm lounging around and I have nothing to do and I just want to be in a t-shirt. But I'm trying to be a fashion icon here, you know, like 2019. Get the fight. I personally like to tie my um t-shirts together. Beauty Guma. This is me tying my shirt. This is me sister smile. See, make a knot like this. I am definitely a fan of this t-shirt because it is not thick at all. So it feels very light for the girlies and your armpits can sweat nicely. I mean, or not sweat at all. I don't like that feeling. But if you're totally into that feeling of sister sweating, then highly recommend you to layer two of these t-shirts up. So buy two. You're welcome, James. My favorite part about this t-shirt, okay. I tend to go for t-shirts that have a longer sleeve like this to cover up the chunky chunk chunks. My arms, they flap. I'm sick of flying when I'm just trying to wave to someone like that, that. That thing flaps. I do not like t-shirts that go up to here because I have broader shoulders. My body is like a triangle, upside down. Like, look how fun. Look how free. So, if you're considering a t-shirt, I highly recommend this one. I think this is like my favorite so far. I think it's time we do the athletic line. Watch out, bitches. Hello, hi. Okay, so here are the leggings. Here is the t-shirt and here is the sports bra. Keep in mind that I'm like 4'11", and so I'm short and stubby. This might not look like how you envision it. Low key, I'm warning myself. So let me just change real quick, and I'll be back. Wow, wow, wow. Exposed. Just to show you quickly, this is the sports bra. I'm gonna make it. My mouth's gonna say this. My Asian mother. I got this sports bra in a large. It was $28. I like the little band down here because you feel like it cinches your waist. Just to let you know, there is no like boob padding so the nymphs if they're cold people will know but i tend to have that problem so this is what the sports bra looks like pouches your girls really nicely so i can't complain i paired it with the leggings and i'm not gonna show you down here i'm not comfortable with that yet this is the sportswear legging and i got it in medium this is for 55 dollars and did i tell the price of this one so this is how the um legs fit they fit pretty well um they're in a medium you know so it's pretty nice I guess I'm just more conservative, so I don't really like to show my body pieces um, tight. This is what you're gonna get. On top of that, we are gonna put this on, and this is the sportswear mock t-shirt, and it ranges for $30 on their website. You know, the iconic mock shirt. <gasps> it's cute. I do like that the neck is not too tight. Sometimes when you have a double chin like me, if you wear too tight of a turtleneck, a mock neck, or whatever kind of shirt that cinches up here, you know, you're not trying, but your double chin will show. Having something a little bit more loose like this, you don't have to worry about like it being like that. The sleeves are definitely my favorite thing about this shirt. Revamp your black. Do something like this. Oh my god, look how like much cooler I look. I like this. I like this. It's just get a boob reduction that's cute i have these sweaters and i have a pink one. Oh, oh, hey there i have a tip out that i would love to share with you so when you have makeup on and you want to take your shirt off but you know it's gonna transfer the thing i highly highly recommend is for you to actually fold the neck probably a million and one times oh shit i just kissed it and then here's the magic i'm going like this if it gets on anything, it'll be the inside of your shirt, not the outside, so you're welcome. Look how cute this sweater is. Originals repeating black hoodie in a large, and it was for $45. The reason I got a large is because I don't like to wear pants. Let's put on our socks. Oh my god, yes. Ha ha, ha ha. And it's a sister. On the back. It's really comfortable. I really like the material as well. It's so soft. The sleeves are this long compared to my, my hands. <laughs> Guys, it's so cute. Put on the white sock. Oh yeah. It's 
like negative 13 degrees outside and I'm sweating. Oh my God. You ever have like a cute date night in? Or a girls night even? Cute and comp. Well, you look lazy, but you're cute and you're like, I know. This is just the original repeating black hoodie in the large and it was four to five dollars again. Listen, a hoodie is meant to be worn. Baggy, loose, and comfy with no pants. I am a hoodie expert, okay? I've been living in hoodies since five ever, so you really can't tell me what's a good hoodie and what's not a good hoodie. And that is how I spent $300 on James Charles outfits. With shipping, it was like $315, but it's fine. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to the Lisa Linda family if you want. But yeah, until next time, I'm Cindy Love.